Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 74 of the full game walkthrough. Today we're going to be starting Dundara. So let's get in here. A giant's tower perches on the path like a gargantuan carrion bird. Perhaps Mallory has a cunning plan to get by it. I believe this is also where we um, can get our crafted spells. I hope I have enough gold for that. But if not... I can just go back there and we'll craft, uh, I think Winter Moon might be the one that I want to get. From what you describe, Dunscathe still stands. The home of the unspeakable Indigo Giant. The Indigo Giant has a taste for all flesh. He must be preying on travelers to Dundara. Venture into his tower and slay him. What were you expecting? A cunning plan? Then, release his captives. This will show you are a friend to the druids who can guide you on to Dundara and Gwendolyn. All right, here we go. Finally getting to our crafted spell area. Let me actually get this stone block, not to delay anything, but let's get this. Now we can head in. I was able to pick up some more ice blade TCs, so now I got uh, a few more of those and I still already have a lot of faints, so I'm good on that. By the skin of my teeth, a little wizard. I just put the pot on the fire, but I don't mind breaking me fast with something raw. Hey, this is fine. He's only storm, so I'll take that. Um, we could use Leviathan. Let's get rid of the blizzard. We're not going to use that. There's our TC faint. Mm. Let's use a TC faint because I don't want him to use a Leviathan and take off her blade and basically just have a wasted turn. If he didn't use Leviathan, um. Oh. Well, shit. Yeah, we just took extra damage for no reason. It was a 50 50 though. Not really. Oh, it's only 500 damage. We're good. See, that was a perfect time to put that on. So now we can actually uh, put on blades without any regret, I guess. At least for a little bit. So we got a faint of blade. Can we get another blade, please? damage on a crit crow wow why do we feel so tanky pretty sure we like we barely have any uh resist i mean like 40 almost 50 but oh, also just a real quick thing to mention i'm trying to make a balance pet right now and for the past two days, I have not seen the balance pet that I've tried to uh, tried to copy. So if anybody knows um, who has the pet, uh, Madam Sandy, it's a gallant bull, uh, triple double pet. So if anybody knows that, please um, put it back in the kiosk if it's not in the kiosk. And if I've just been getting really unlucky this whole time, um, well, shit. I know it, like, goes back in every hour, so maybe I just need to check it off. But I also just really don't want to do that every hour, every day. I'm really just hoping it, it's just not in the, the kiosk and, and it'll be put in the kiosk again. Oh, we actually killed. I wasn't even paying attention. I'll wear the shame of this defeat for a lifetime. Oh, here's Grady.
We do have enough. So maybe I should just go ahead and buy all the ones. Well, hold up. It's 60,000, so I would only get that one. <laughs> Pigsy. Winter Moon. See, I could do Winter Moon and actually like be able to craft it because I have everything. I'm pretty sure on like separate accounts. So I could just go ahead and get Winter Moon. It costs six pips now? Four and a... Damn. Than this. Is this actually stronger? Wait, is this actually stronger than, um, than Blizzard? Wait, it is. Hold on, I might, might honestly have to craft Angry Snow Pig. I don't know how I'm going to get these TCs, but... Yeah, let's go ahead and buy it for now. Um, so Angry Snow Pig um, and Winter Moon are probably going to be the only ones that I craft, because where is Handsome Fomori? Uh, five pips and minus. It might be good for PvP. Maybe. Anyways. Let's continue. Free these captives real quick. And then we should be able to go to Dundara already. Good wizard, you freed us from a terrible demise. Somebody How can we ever repay you? You are searching for Dundara? Let us show you the secret path, friend. Look for Aeolt when you arrive. So if he knew the secret path, why didn't he just go through? Okay, so I actually don't remember what this area is like, so it looks like there's some recipes over there. Uh, we got a teleporter. We're going to find out. There's the queen. Greetings, friend. If you know of me, Doran must have sent you. Now, how can I help you? You're looking for Gwendolyn. Aye, the queen is here. Go and present yourself. Hello. Are you a mysterious wizard, a questing knight? A virtuous hero, or something of each. You are searching for the Sword of Kings? Who put you on this quest? Merle Ambrose? <laughs> of course that trickster would still live. I see you are no full knight yet. You must finish proving yourself before you might be able to wield the Sword of Kings. Meditate at the Lightning Burnt Tree on Dragon Hill to summon Sir George Martin and ask him to knight you. I can actually get knighted here? Wow. Hopefully nothing goes wrong with this plan, like it always does. Is the tree not there or something? What's gonna happen? Oh, it's actually here. This tree has been the victim of countless lightning blasts. You might not want to get too close. You close your eyes and meditate on the nightly virtues you have learned about so far. Suddenly there is a crash of thunder. A pilgrim from Dandara or from much farther away? Oh, here he is. Hail and well met, Knight Errand. Why do you come to this forsaken place? Queen Gwendolyn sent you for my counsel? Please? I was a famous worm slayer in my day until Catalan, the lightning lizard, ended my string of victories. It still preys on the weak and powerless. Could you find Catalan in its lair and defeat it, easing my burden? Sure, we'll we'll do this. It's fine. Hopefully he's storming in, so then we can have an easier time. Well, I say e easier, but it looks like they don't have much less health anymore. Actually, their health is. It has been a long average. time since I feasted on a knight. Once my lightning cooks you, you'll taste like smoked bacon. <laughs> That slurp, though. Hold up a second. I thought this was a kid's game. Excuse me, sir.
But they really like using sirens. Now that I think about it, that's a rank 9 spell that they're using pretty much all the time. Oh wait, actually we got that at level 68, that makes sense. We're actually very close to level 80, and I haven't even realized that. Oh, we fizzed? Are you kidding me? Come on, Cookie, you could have done better. Excuse me, what did I just say? You could have done better. Okay, we got our blade. You know, at least I don't have any fear of actually dying in these fights yet. Of course, it might change towards the end of this world um, in like the, the final dungeon, but like so far I've just been heading into it because I don't think there's anything like scary about it. At least I don't think. Like nothing like Belloc or anything. I mean the Jabberwock was, was something, but it was actually a lot easier than what I thought it was going to be. Or what I've remembered it anyways. And I think maybe the, the reason why it felt so hard then, I guess is because I remember um, back on my first playthrough of Avalon. Um, I honestly don't think I knew the cheats, so I thought that the, the Meteor Strike was just random. And I guess that makes sense as to why I would think it's much harder than it actually is. I guess if you know the cheats for everything, it just makes everything easy. Minus 15 ink will save him though. We still need one more blade and then one more faint. Hopefully we can grab our blade pretty soon. Let's get rid of the blizzard. We're not going to use it. And just go ahead and throw in our faint. Now if he uses it next turn, I'm going to be mad. Please just use like Stormzilla. I mean, I don't care if you do that much damage, it's okay. It's actually a lot of damage though. Oh shit, and I have a plus 30 on me too. I'm praying. Yes, okay. He used up all his pips, now we can just go ahead and use our frost right next turn without any worries. Still 700 damage though. Okay, thank you, Cookie, for not fizzing this time, even though it's 100%. Okay, please one shot just like the last one. Can they please bring back the block animation? Like, I want to know if I actually did crit through or not. Not until, like, the, the last part, so then I can actually start celebrating. I don't know if that's just me. Oh no, we only did 700. I definitely should have bladed. Oh no, we're not gonna kill. We gotta wait for this freaking frost giant. He actually might kill us before then. We just have to live two turns. Hold up a second, this this might have to be close. No blade leviathan, does that kill? 
Does that kill us? Whatever he's doing, it's gonna hit us. Try it. Okay. I don't think this kills, does it? Wait, he crit? No. But if he crits a... Oh, shit. Are you kidding me? Yes. Now, whatever you do, please do not fizz. Don't do it. Yes. I swear, if it would have been the one time where I started talking about how easy it was and we died, that would have been so stupid. Why was this such a hard fight? This didn't have to be. Literally, if I had just bladed and used a frost giant, it would have, oh, he dropped the Catalan CC, that's cool. But I would have been fine if that happened. You danced with a dragon and survived. You fought a great battle against Catalan. You have a future in Wormslang if you ever want to give up the wizard life. You have eased my heavy burden, but I cannot knight you. I am sorry, but I am too far gone. Too far on the other side. There are many things I cannot do, such as taste honeyed fowl or lemon cakes again. Go back to Queen Gwendolyn and tell her of your deed. Why couldn't you literally just... Okay, why not just tell me who can? Or wait, hold up. There has to be... There's literally knights in the... The first area. They can't knight us? Does it have to be from a ghost? You defeated Catalan? That is a great victory for the good people of Avalon. I can tell you have visited several of the nightly shrines. The shrine to nobility of kings and knights and common people like you is in disrepair. Speak to Bridget in the burial ground and find out how to repair the shrine to nobility. Return here. here when it is restored. Let's grab the mist wood. Sadly, um, as soon as I posted in my last video, the member benefits disappeared. I think, I think I mentioned that, or I, I think I didn't mention that. I'm not, I'm not even sure at this point. Knight Errant, you seek to reclaim the shrine to nobility? The shrine's sacred shield was ripped away by the ogre, Erg. Erg dwells in the Fraudling village. Recover the shield and have it repainted before you return it to the shrine. Oh, cool. Another fight. Just what I wanted. Let's actually see if we can find a wisp. There's one. Actually, there's one right here. No, we have to go this way. Let's head in. Uh, make sure we have TCs in here. We should be good. My name is Erg. I, so are you kidding me? And Why? And your face will be broken. I'll leave you split. Ice Why and balance, the two most annoying schools. Okay, there is our prism. Any so the storm bosses literally had the same amount of health as the ice. I guess I'm not complaining about this one though, because the health is a little bit lower. And of course, we're gonna be able to boost on them too. Excuse me. Already? Maybe I need to put cleanse charms in here. Okay, so maybe what we're gonna do is frost giant into a mammoth. So let's actually just use like, what do you say? Well, hold up a second. 
I mean, I guess I can double blade. I don't know though, because this minus 40 might not actually kill. I mean, I guess if we're gonna get that far, maybe we just use all of our blades here. Excuse me. Hello? Does. Okay, so balance is the most annoying school now. Um. I'm gonna faint her. It. it, it. Alright, I'm glad he used the most useless spell in the game. Can do like, what, 10 damage? This minion's putting in work, holy shit. Okay, so we already have that. Mm. Last time we got rid of the blizzard and it, it kind of hurt us a little bit. So let's get rid of a frost giant. Maybe, yeah, let's get rid of the frost giant. Yeah, there's our blade. I did want to get rid of the reshuffle. Let me guess, minus 15. Crit, okay. So, do, mm, maybe I should use Reindeer Knight. Instead of Frost Giant. Because of the minus 50? Maybe? I'm not really sure. Yeah, let's go ahead and try doing that. So then essentially it's doing the same amount of damage, but... <laughs> they really want me to quit today, huh? That's where they always test my patience here. And it's always the balance. I don't want to say anything, but you notice how the ice hasn't done anything annoying yet? Yet. Really too... Mm. And crit block? So the boss didn't block, but the minion did? What the hell? Hold up a second. What is this? All right. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. And just hope that we crit. This might actually be the fight that ends me. If we die to this fight. I, I mean, it's looking pretty, pretty bad for us. I mean, at least that's only doing a hundred. Crit. Please crit through. That's just barely not going to do enough, is it? 600. Um. Yeah, we got a blade up now. The minion's not even going to be dead from all this. Are you joking? They just had to freaking crib block. If it wasn't for the crib block, it would already be dead. But no, it just had to crib block. Let's try putting on this ice blade again. I think we're gonna have to go for a frost giant. I think that's the only way. Cause like, oh, how much health does she have left? It, 
I don't know what it is. I probably should not assume. Okay, so I have enough for a frost giant. 120. Mm. I guess there's one. Let's put another ice blade on. Hopefully we can get another TC next turn. At least I hit the weakest one. We're really gonna barely squeak this out, I think. So we need one more. Oh, we need to put the prism on. Let's put the prism on. I'm not mad about that. Okay, please. Please, we got three turns to get through. Especially because we have we have two faint rounds and then we have the hit round. So we just gotta survive three rounds without any disruptions is that even a word hold on I gotta google that please tell me that's a word and I didn't just sound stupid I did use it right. Disruption, disturbance of problems which interrupt an event, activity, or process. Yes! I actually said something that wasn't stupid. There you go, you learn uh, something whenever you watch these videos. You now know what disruption means. If you're in 8th grade and you don't know already. Or may maybe, maybe you are in 8th grade and you know more than me, which could probably happen. Actually, it's probably more likely. Okay, so we just have to get through this next round. Please. They don't have any pips, so I don't think that they can kill us. If they can do other things, they would not be so pleasant. Please. Okay, here's our frost giant. I'm going to use it now. Just don't... Yes! Okay, if we fizz, I'm quitting the game, I swear. Okay, I guess they didn't want me to quit. That's fine. We did kill. Yes! Finally, two back-to-back -back fights that we actually got really low, though. I lost to a skinny wizard. In the old days, I would have killed him. Oh. You find the shrine Sacred Shield amongst the ogre's collected treasures. It's been pretty badly banged up. You should take it to the master arms painter, Ashlyn Brushtail, to clean before it. Before we do that, let's actually grab these wisps. You need my help to touch up a relic from the shrine to nobility? I'd be honored. Let's see what I can do. Ashlyn mixes a batch of paints and gets to work. It's amazing what a talented artist can do, seemingly effortlessly. There you go. What do you think? You should be able to ease it back into its spot on the shrine.
That looks great. A proper shrine to nobility of kings and knights and common people like you. You have restored the shrine to nobility. Well done. It is not enough to raise your status, but it shows your dedication. You need to pluck a silver rose from the garden at the Tower of Bel Regard. You'll have to deal with the Black Knight. None shall pass. You insist? Then meet me inside, Belregard, with your weapon of choice in hand. Alright, I'm actually going to cut this video in half, so this will be the end of the first one, and then the next one will be starting up here and hopefully finishing Dendara. Thank you for watching this video, and then uh, hopefully you guys would want to join the Discord in the description there's a link if you wanted to join um and then hopefully i see you in the next video